So we're gonna show you how to actually um, get energy into your wallet. A lot of people um, are having issues um, because they're trying to make transaction, but because of the new blockchain that the Tron network implemented back in December, you must have energy and bandwidth in your wallet before you can do a transaction, right? So we are on the dashboard of your Tron wallet, as you can see here. Now you can see at the very top, you have energy and bandwidth. Bandwidth normally is there when you're sending the funds to it, but if you wanna make a transaction, you gotta have energy. So the first thing you wanna do is click freeze. Freeze is right here. Click on the freeze. And here you can uh, freeze at least minimum 50 trons to give you some, for each transaction, the one might cost might be like about say 50 trons, could be less depending on the amount. So. As, let me go back. As you can see here, my energy is up to 31K because I've been adding and freezing um, okay. trons, right? So to accumulate these bandwidth. But when you do freeze your coins, you still have them. It's just on the blockchain, which you freeze them to get, you know, so you can do transactions. So my bandwidth is 5,542, which is okay. Um, my energy is that. If I wanted to add more energy, I just simply click on to energy. And we scroll down here and you see where it says freeze. Now I can either freeze for energy or bandwidth. So now we selected in the blue energy, which is right here, right? Now if I click onto bandwidth, that's selected. Okay. But I'm gonna show you how to do it for energy. So you can do the same thing for bandwidth. So I go back to energy because I'm gonna do it for energy, right? And yes. I put in say 50 trons, five zero. Okay. And I scroll down. Remember, remember, for each one you're doing, you gotta make sure you check either energy or bandwidth you wanna get, you want to have, right? Yes. Normally, like I said, your bandwidth is always if you send anything to the wallet, you always get bandwidth. But energy, you always have to freeze for, depending on what you, how many transactions you you want to make. So, I put in fifty trons, and I just click done. This is on my wallet. I have the Apple phone, so when I click freeze. And it's gonna ask me for my, to put in, to confirm the trons, right? And the bandwidth is gonna be taken is 251 bandwidth as you can see there. So I click confirm and then I will need to put in Okay, now my password is in, I'm gonna click done. And it's loading, it said transaction completed, Did you see that? Yes. Now if I go back, remember I had, I think it was 51K, was what, 31K, so now I have more bandwidth. And it's as simple as that. Okay, it has increased. Correct. C so goes to 32K, right? Yeah. So you always got to check your bandwidth and your energy when you're doing a transaction. Like I said, when you send trans to the wallet, to this wallet in particular, you always get bandwidth from them. Norm norm normally starts at 5,000. But your energy, you always have to freeze some trans for. So you always want to check to see your energy is good or your bandwidth. Otherwise, you are going to not able to do any transaction. So that's what a lot of people issue people having. They do not know how to actually um, save energy for their wallets. All right. Remember, like if you're doing Ethereum, they charge a lot of gas fees, but with Tron, you just charge a little bit of energy, but you do get those coins back. You can go back and freeze them. It gives you a date. So if I were to go back here and I want to click on to say freeze again. Uh, the drop down at freeze, I can do this right here on freeze. I can click on freeze and unfreeze them depending on the date. Because you get a date when you can unfreeze them. You can just freeze them and unfreeze them right away, right? So yes. if I click freeze, it will tell me a date that I can unfreeze there. It should show a date somewhere down here. Yes. On freezing time, it says July 1st, 2021. You see that? So I can't unfreeze those. I just froze, right? Before yeah. July, it has to be after July 1st before I can unfreeze those new ones. 
You get what I'm saying? They always okay. give you. So that's how simple it is to um, freeze energy or freeze strands to get energy in your wallet. All right? Okay, sir. That's good, sir. I got it. Yes, yeah, sounds good. I want to I want to buy COA five so that mm -hmm. uh, on the first, as you are buying, just make sure you wake me up. As you are buying on first of July, I want to buy three thousand dollar worth of uh, Daisy token. The, the the on the first day, one Daisy token will be how much? Zero point how much? Do you have idea? How much dollar? 